Hi, so I just got back from running some errands. I went to Rite Aid because Wet n Wild was on sale, buy one, get one 50% off. And then I also went to Big Lots. So at Rite Aid, I bought some Wet n Wild products, obviously, because that's why I went. Uh, the first thing I got was the Walking on Eggshells palette, which everybody loves. And I go through these quite often, so it's a good thing they're really cheap. I think they're $2.99, so $2.99, 50% off. So that was the first one I got. And then I got some blushes. I hear everybody talking about their blushes, and I only ever wear their eyeshadow. So I thought I'd pick up some blush. This is Pearlescent Pink. And I opened these before I filmed. There's that. And I don't know if my lighting is good enough to do a swatch pickup, but there is a swatch of that on the back of my hand. It's very pretty and pigmented, so I'm hoping that that works really well. The next one I have is Mellow Wine. That's that one. There's that. And this is what it looks like. It looks like it's going to be a very pretty color for fall. And there it is on my hand. Hopefully that picks that up. And then I got two lipsticks. This one is 920C, and the color is Bare It All, and it looks like when I rip this off, the color is going to be gone too, so I'll just rip this off now. Probably should have done this before I started to tape, but that's okay. There's this one. Bare It All, and swatch it on my hand. Definitely a nude color. I like it. Oh, I don't really care for the fact that it doesn't go in the whole way. It's a little bit smashed on it. And this one is spiked with rum. And the number is 915B. And let's see here. Of course, it would be hard to open. Um, holy crap. I should have learned my lesson to always open these whenever I first get them instead of trying to do it on video. So here's that one. And what was it? I don't know. Spice of rum or something. And wow, that's red. Okay, it's the middle one here. So there's that. And then I went to Big Lots. And I just picked up some random things. I got, oh, the Yardley Soap that I like. This is a limited edition Sugar Plum Blossom for a buck. Bargain. So I got that. And then I picked up the Strike a Posy Maybelline Lip Gloss. Lip Gloss. Lipstick. Oh, this is the color Sensational line. And... Let me wipe off my hand so I can do another swatch. Here, I'll swatch it on this hand. Strike a posy. Oh, it's what I have on my lips, too, because I had to try it out as soon as I bought it and brought it home. Oh, this was $1.50. And then I got um, some perfumes. They were, like, impression perfumes. Which I was going to show, but I'm not going to show because some of them are gifts. So, let's just say I got a couple perfumes. And then, I got this Physician's Formula Bronzer in light. It's the Healthy Wear. I've never tried this, and I've been wanting to try it. This was 4 bucks, And it's really cute. It has a little brush. Here's the product in the mirror. Sorry if I'm blinding you. And I'm hoping to wear this as a pressed powder because... Obviously, that's not bronzer color. I wasn't sure what to expect whenever I got it. But. So there's that. And I also picked up two things of cotton pads. I think they're both 100% cotton. Yeah, they are. And they were both $1.20. This one and this one. I'm always looking for a good cotton pad for makeup removal and nail polish removal because sometimes I don't want... To use a cotton ball. A lot of times these are so chintzy, chintzy they fall apart. 
this one's really soft, so hopefully it doesn't fall apart. That one is this one. And then, let me see here. They looked a little different in texture, so I thought I'd try them both. Uh, this one's definitely more nail polishy. It has that. These are a lot better made. This will be for the face. This will be for the fingernails. And that should work pretty good. So, that's everything I bought. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. Until next time. Bye.